to the broadcast side for the first time. LaJoy up. McAvoy, she's got Hosking on here. She'll head in that direction now. It sits for Sarah. She had McLeod out the other side of the rearview mirror, but almost a sixth sense that the twin sister oh. was there. Oh, in the breeze. Brown, Hunt. Back to Heron. Good from the Bulldogs. Good pressure from the Blues, though. Brown gathers, shovels it off. Stepping through Giorgio Stathis. Here comes Hosking. Brilliant tackle. And this game's got a bit of everything right now. So here's the original tackle, which was very well executed from Sarah Hosking. What's the aftermath? Drops out the back and pound. A little bit of breathing space, although this kick puts Hosking under pressure. Went for the free kick and probably should have got it in the end. Uh, she went tangled to ground with Hunt. Clark has put it in reverse. Hunt will try and chop it off. Bodied by Hosking. Hunt goes over the top to try and win it. Brown came through. Hunt being legged. <laughs> sort of thing you do to your kids. Oh, he's reversed it here. kick will go the other way. Hosking to take the free kick. Decides to move the ball quickly. Has the run of Presparkas. I said the front on contact was okay. Hunt. Heron's probably had the best of her three AFLW games so far. Hosking waited for it on the bounce, kept it alive, and advantage Bulldogs. Lachlan Ford, no free kick will come back, so go the way of one of the Hoskins, <laughs> given both are in shot. Hard to tell, isn't well, it? Well, it's it was, it was more deciding. Do you want it? Do you want it? It's like Christmas morning. <laughs> Sarah Hosking will take the free, just getting out of the way to let her sister take it. So Sarah, who's played in all 26 of the Blues games so far, puts this ball back into attack. Tight tussle early on in this second half. McAvoy. Hand pass off. Rennie chops it off to Lockland. Under pressure, the kick. Didn't have the carry on it very near the line. Gee, she's doubled her career goal tally this afternoon. Hadn't kicked a goal since the corresponding round last year. She's got two on the afternoon. Hosking clears a path from the centre of the ground. Foot race in shoes. Winning it in the end. Steady as gamble. She's met solidly by Lawrence. She kick won't be a free kick. Mark intercept to Sarah Hosking. And she's got Harrington screaming for it in the middle of the ground. Lamb able to cut her off now. Hosking goes low, short. Loins makes good of it. The kick has come for too good. There's quite a bit of company, including Hosking. Able to at least force a stoppage. Blues again. McAvoy to Hosking. On the right, looking for G. They're on the bounce. She's got G and Hosking for company. That wasn't the required distance. And look at the pincer movement from Vessio. What a tackle it was on Heron Blues. So they're going to write their season at 2-1. And, and after being outplayed by Collingwood last Sunday, they face the Crows. Your Crows next Sunday, Chelsea Randall, <laughs> over in Adelaide. And then a run ahead that features St Kilda, Melbourne, West Coast and Freo to close out the year. The Blues go back to back in the Pride game and restore some pride with a 21-point victory.